Good day students, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, we will be looking at dispersa of fruit and seed. Under this topic, we will be looking at what is the meaning of dispersa. We will be looking at the various agents that bring about dispersa of fruit and seed. And we will be looking at their characteristics. And we will also be looking at the advantages of this dispersa of fruit and seed. Let's start with what dispersa is. What is dispersa? Dispersa refers to the transfer of fruit and seed from the parent plant to other places. The various ways by which fruit and seed are dispersed include a self disperser or explosive mechanism, b animal disperser, c water, d wind. Let's look at animal dispersal. Example of fruits that are dispersed by animal include mango, orange, purple, etc. Let's look at the features and the characteristics of these fruits. Number one, they must be edible. Number two, they have sticky pericarp, like in desmodium and pig wheat. Example, what we mean by uh, pericarp is the outer covering of the fruits. It comprises of the epicarp, the mesocarp, and the endocarp. They also have presence of hooks on some fruits or seed, like in starboard, which, which allow this fruit to be attached to animal's body so that they can be moved around as the animal is moving from one place to another. Let's move on to water disperser. A very good example of fruit that is dispersed by water is coconut and it has the following characteristics. Number one, fibrous mesocarp for buoyancy. Number two, seed chamber for floating. Number three, waterproof epicarp. I've told you earlier, epicarp is the outer part of the pericarp, which is the outer covering of the fruit. They also have lightweight for them to be able to float on water. Let's now move on to the wind dispersed fruit or seed. Example in this case is Tridas and Combrenton. Characteristics. Number one, they have purpose like in Tridas that act as parachutes. Combrenton has wings just like the picture that is shown on the screen for you. Then cutting seed has floss which make them to be carried by winds. Then they also have light weights and some of them are dry and the seed are always flat. Let's move on to explosive mechanism. Example of fruits that are dispersed by explosive mechanism include oil bean, pride of Barbados, flamboyant, balsam and crotalaria. Explosive mechanism involve the splitting of such fruits due to pressure and tension that build up within it as a result of uneven drying up of the pericarp. What are the features of seed or fruit that are dispersed by explosive mechanism? Number one, they have presence of one or more line of weakness or fusion of carpel. They have uh, what we call line of suture. Another thing is that when the pericarp dry up, it contracts, leading to the explosion that we call explosive mechanism. Then what are the advantages of dispersal? Number one, it prevents overcrowding. Number two, it also helps to reduce competition. Number three, new areas are colonized by plants number four it enables barren land to be covered with vegetation number five it helps to perpetuate species in new areas to prevent them from being wiped out by natural disaster and number six it prevents diseases from spreading among plant species please Subscribe to my channel. God bless you as you subscribe.